please subscribe and follow me on Instagram. Hey guys, I'm going to show you how I do my eyebrows so that you can learn to do it too. My eyebrows are a huge mess right now. <laughs> I've been growing them just for this video. I'm not an expert, but I've been doing this for years now. And I'll be using a thread and a plucker to do this. There I'm using a used mascara wand to comb them. You can use a simple comb, small comb. So this is the important part. I'm drawing a boundary uh, which will help me create a shape. If you are a beginner, this boundary will work as a GPS that you have in Google Maps. It will give you a direction and makes the whole process easy. If you want thick eyebrows, then make a wider boundary. So the shape of this boundary depends on what you want. I'll be removing the hair that is outside the boundary. This hair that, that are on the line, they will go too. I'm not gonna talk about how to do threading in this video, but if you want to know more about threading, there's another video, I'll link it in the description. When you're doing this, please take your time, especially when you're closer to the boundary and always thread in the opposite direction of the hair growth. When you're doing this part, raise your eyebrows a little. That would open up the area and makes it clear and it's good for your skin too. I'm using a plucker to get the hair from all the difficult areas. Don't hesitate to use a plucker. We can't get all of them using a thread, at least I can't. So it's okay to use a plucker. This part might seem a little difficult, but with some experience and patience, you'll master it. I again used a plucker for these corner areas. As I'm done doing the bottom part, it's time for the upper part, which is much easier. Stay with me till the end to know more tips about how to match both the eyebrows. Please let me know in the comments if you do your eyebrows too. I'll be happy to know more about your experiences. Please do comment. I'll trim these ends a little with my scissors. This is how it looks and I'll be doing this eyebrow based on this one. This eyebrow has a deeper arc compared to the other one. I'll smoothen it a little. So I drew my boundary based on the idea of reducing the arc. And this hair here is longer than the other one, so I'll trim them a little. I didn't show how I did the other eyebrow on camera because it was difficult to film and do it. This is how they look in the end. They are not the most perfect eyebrows, but they look much better than what they did before doing this. Your eyebrows might not look similar to each other, mine don't. And it's the case with a lot of people, so it's completely okay. By following the steps I showed, you can bring the similarity a little closer. So that's it. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Bye guys!